General coaching 10 years in rugby come in four-year cycles, running from World Cup to World Cup. The Springboks have done things differently this time around and kept the bulk of their coaches, with one being promoted to the head coach role. Well, if you think in Springbok history, it's never, ever happened that, you know, a guy a coach stays on. I think it's the right way going forward. I've, I've seen the Saracens, uh, what, what difference they can make. You know, and Jock is a great coach. He's, uh, he's learned a lot, grown a lot, and uh, I think it's the right time for him to take over. Rassi will still be involved from the top, looking down and still helping from a technical perspective. Um, yeah, so it, it's going to be great. The decision has some fans and most, if not all, the players excited to what the future holds under Ninaber. The whole South Africa is really excited for Coach Chalk Nida uh, being appointed as a Springbok coach and I think, or I don't think, I believe that he will do, do a good job uh, for the Springboks and, and the country. Um, he's been working with Coach Arasi for, for a long time and they've been through so many systems together. So yeah, I really, I really see a lot of positive things happening in, in SA Rugby and I'm sure the players around and the, the talent in South Africa and players being overseas, um, South Africa can really be a team um, that can dominate. All over international. Two tests against Scotland and one against Georgia will be Ninaba's first assignment on home soil in July. Justin Ford, Cape Town.